So I come in every day and I feed the biodigester. The staff have been trained on how to separate the waste. They're not allowed to put in any tins, any plastic bags, any plastic bottles. Separated scrap food and waste are taken from the UCT canteen to the outside biodigester. Due to urbanisation, the, the cities are experiencing high volumes of waste uh, being generated because cities' infrastructures are not able to deal with the amount of waste. The waste is mixed in and begins decomposition and gas production. The reason why we have this biodigester here is to demonstrate that it is possible to generate energy from source separated waste, from canteens and from restaurants around urban areas. Water is added to facilitate the decomposition process and manufacture of gas. I just have to make sure I'm monitoring every day and make sure the pH doesn't drop too low because obviously if it drops too low we're not making enough of the right type of gas. Gas released is piped back to the canteen to be used for preparing food. The gas from the biodigester is lit and available for cooking. Definitely, we think the potential is there. We just need to learn how to do it properly. It was very exciting for a lot of people who didn't think it all work. When they saw it burn, then they had a little bit of faith in what we were doing. This is the first project at UCT. Uh, we feel it's successful. It has been successful so far. Oh, there's a lot of potential. I'd like to see it in a lot of other races and see how far we can go with this. We're really excited about the project and we, we, it's our vision that uh, similar systems are installed all over, all over the city to address uh, solid waste management and climate change.